buddy, what can I say about She-Hulk? She's a beautiful lady. Beautiful lady. And uh, that's why I'm worried. That's why I'm worried about Marvel's upcoming She-Hulk Disney Plus series, for which the new trailer has just dropped. And we're going to take a look at the trailer and we're going to see how we feel. Now, I have not watched it. But my concern, of course, is that we live in a modern age where a character like She-Hulk... Let's be clear, this is a real comic cover where uh, they told the readers, if you don't subscribe to uh, She-Hulk, if you don't buy it at your local comic store, we're going to have to force her to get naked and jump rope. And uh, the, because the character's always a bit tongue-in-cheek, uh, was a bit uh, erotic, not over the top, still very PG-13, but an attractive lady... And it's supposed to be fun, it's supposed to be funny, uh, it's supposed to be sexy. She-Hulk is supposed to be a sexy character. And I'm worried, I'm worried, will they retain the fun and the spirit of the original She-Hulk? Or is it going to be, and you know I hate using this word, but you use your word, are they going to make it woke? Is it going to go woke and get broke? My least favorite thing in the world is when that happens. We're going to watch the trailer, we're going to find out. Before we get into it, hit that subscribe button down there. Looks like I'm pointing at She-Hulk's crotch, but I'm actually trying to point at the subscribe button. We have the official trailer for She-Hulk, a Disney original, here on the Marvel Entertainment site with, wow, 16 million views. Can you believe it? 600,000, almost 700,000 up likes. I don't have that thing. I got to get that thing that shows the dislikes. But you in the comments, let me know. How many dislikes does it have? Because they hide them. Let's see. What is the description? You'll like her when she's angry. She-Hulk Attorney at Law, an original series from Marvel Studios, starts streaming August 17 on Disney. Now, I know what I would like this show to be. There's a lot of fun you can have with a lawyer in the Marvel Universe figuring out the various legal logistics of this uh, nonsense of what's going on. But let's see if that's actually what they did. Let's get ready for She-Hulk Attorney at Law. Ooh. Being Wah. a superhero. Wah. Is a trial by fire. Who's going to protect the world if not people like you? All right. Getting some butt early on. I'm excited. I'm Jennifer Walters. I'm a lawyer. I have uh, great friends. Can we get some shots, please? It's an emergency. A uh, demanding job. We just started a superhuman law division, and I want you to be the face of it. Okay. So right off the bat, look, I'm happy. I get a little butt shit. This is me. Vito's going to be a bit of a pervert. I don't care. Okay? Because let's be clear. Comic books are directed at young men. Maybe maybe even older men. Men, children like myself. They're supposed to get us excited. What do we want? We want action. We want suspense, drama. Well, a little of that TNA. Okay? And I'm not ashamed to say that. Okay? So I got all excited seeing her butt. But now I'm seeing this the actress. I don't know. I don't know. She's not... She's not the, the sexiest lady. I want my She-Hulk. Am I being mean? Maybe she gets sexier as it goes on. She's going to let her hair down. We're going to see, okay? And is this S.H.I.E.L.D.? What is this here? Where is she going Manding to work? job. We just started a superhuman law division, and I want you to be the face of it. And a frustrating uh, family. Because we didn't ask for this, but you still got to deal with it. Okay, so I was confused because I saw some screenshots where... Banner is Bruce Banner. Here he's clearly Nerd Hulk, which is fun. Or not, what, what did he call him? Genius Hulk? Is it Nerd, Nerd Hulk? I don't remember what they called him. Professor Hulk. There he is. Uh, good for him. But we'll see how that goes, because I, I thought I saw some scenes where he turns back into regular boring Bruce Banner. He had a, a broken arm. I wonder what that's from. Was that from Thor? Because we didn't ask for this, but you still got to deal with it. The transformations are triggered by anger and fear. Those are like the baseline of any woman just existing. Oh. Ha 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 ha. If I don't transform, I'm gonna die. Yes, yes, yes. No, no. I just want to be. All right, you got a chuckle out of me. You got a chuckle out of me, She Hulk trailer. All right, you got a little chuckle from me. I find that comical. All right, this is a nice setup. It does, again, look like a Disney Plus show. They always look... I don't know. I guess for a, for a pilot episode, this looks like it has some somewhat of a budget. I just don't know about this lady. She's not... She's not. I'm being a misogynist. But I'm like, come on. Is this is this my She-Hulk? Let's see. No, no. I just want to be a normal, anonymous lawyer. Can oh, wait. Is that our first shot at She-Hulk? So as I said to my buddy, 
you know, this show, she should grow to be 50 feet tall. And uh, what do you call it? She should eat people whole <laughs> and ingest them. And the whole season should be someone inside her belly getting digested. This is a joke about internet fetish communities. But you know that's why people are going to be watching this. They're going to be watching it. It's the giantess, uh, what do you call it, community that wants a big lady to pick them up and cradle them like a little baby. She's looking, I don't know, how does the CG look here? Is this going to set the fetishists on fire and they're going to be excited? Are they going to want She-Hulk to inflate them like a balloon and then eat them whole? That's what I'm trying to figure out here. It kind of looks kind of looks not great. Gamora looks good. So Gamora is a green-skinned lady in the Marvel Universe. This looks like they did it in post. Like that they didn't just put green makeup on her. And whenever they try to do this stuff in post, I think it always looks like crap. It looks kind of crappy. Am I wrong? Let's see. A normal, anonymous lawyer. Can you tell us where She-Hulk is? Jen, you're a story now. Girl, your ass looks crazy. Hold on. She doesn't... She looks okay. I don't know, man. This definitely looks like they digitally touched the skin in post, but they couldn't have. They're not that stupid, so why does it kind of look like crap? I hate to say it. I don't know. She's just not the best looking lady. She looks kind of. I don't. I don't. I don't want to be a misogynist, but I'm not getting. A, I'm not getting a chub for She Hulk. That was a nice shot. You could be an Avenger. Oh, I'm not a superhero. That is for billionaires and narcissists and adult orphans for some reason. All right. So Abomination, it looks like, is back. We got a quick shot of that, if you remember. Wasn't he the uh, villain in the Incredible Hulk movie with Edward Norton that immediately got retconned? Let's see. Here's our big shot. Getting some crotch in my face. We'll see. We'll see. It looks like they are kind of trying to do the hair of She-Hulk. But I think it kind of looked better in the comics. I think now her hair kind of looks frumpy and she looks homeless. <laughs> Is there anything more depressing than dating in your 30s? Yeah, this is the best date I've had in a while. Oh. Should we split some fries? Let's get those to go. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Hold a man like a little baby, inflate him like a balloon, put him in your mouth. Here's the problem I'm seeing right now is uh, this should just be a comedy show about a lawyer doing lawyer stuff. But instead, it looks like she's going to be fighting guys and, like, punching and whatever else i don't know i mean i kind of want something new from the marvel universe so i was like oh a procedural crime drama where like different super villains have done stuff and she's got to prosecute them that would be much more interesting to me than you know girl boss goes and fights guys now it could be that they're just this is all in the trailer it's kind of hard to tell what the show exactly is about but when i see the abomination or whatever his name is I assume she's going to end up fighting him, and it's not going to be like a court thing. I don't know. It could be a big mislead, though. It's hard to nail down what this show's about. Ultimately, here she looks good. It kind of changes from scene to scene. Sometimes uh, She-Hulk is hot, and sometimes she's just like a dumpy lady. I don't know. I feel bad, and I know there's ladies in my audience who watch my videos, and I'm sure you're all beautiful. I just expect a certain level of attractiveness from my She-Hulk. Again, this is what I'm looking for. Am I being a misogynist? Yes, and I'm sorry, but that's just the way I am. Regardless, if any woman who is seven foot, eight foot tall wants to come to my apartment and carry me like a little baby, uh, I'm all for it. I'm I'm down. Let's do it. What do you guys think? We didn't get a lot from this trailer. I'm hoping that it is a funny, and I did get a good laugh. I'm hoping we get more Mark Ruffalo because he's great. So I'm hoping that we get a fun, funny like lawyer show. But if it ends up just being a stupid slugfest, you know, a girl boss, whatever the hell, adventure of her going going around the globe, stopping threats, I don't want that. It should be it should be like Birdman, attorney at law. There's so much comedy you could uncover in the Marvel Universe. I'm hoping that's the route they go. But let me know what you think in the comments. Did you like it? Did you think the CG or whatever? Well, I don't know how they did her skin. I thought it looked kind of cheap in some scenes, good in other scenes. Hopefully they just end up using makeup. Because it just always looks better. Stop trying to digitally change the skin, which kind of looks like they're doing. What would you think? Did it look good? Don't forget, subscribe to the channel. And also, check out my comic book, Super Killer, 
and uh, join the mailing list. You'll get you'll get a notification when the comic book goes live, so you can be one of the first to read it. Oh my God, what's in my throat? I don't know. I gotta go. Have fun. I love you. Bye bye.